post-match. And Michael, with the championship on the line, you know these guys are going to do whatever it takes to leave here with it. They're struggling for control right now. Oh, struggle is right, Cole. This is really back and forth. And here's Triple H. Well, taking a look at Triple H, what's the lowdown here? That's someone who gets it. Someone who knows the value of hard work and dedication. A reversal from Ambrose. Oh, that was slick. Dean Ambrose is really going to town right now. Triple H is part of an elite group where the mere mention of his name invokes visions of history. His greatest moment in WWE lore might just be at the end of an era match where he, along with The Undertaker and Shawn Michaels, are standing together, arm in arm, looking out at the crowd of more than 78,000. I get chills just thinking about it. Man, I do too. And you know, Michael, when you think about it, all the great moments, all the history this man has made, all of them that I've called as a broadcaster, I don't know if anything will top when Triple H returned to WWE after suffering what we thought was a career-ending torn quadriceps injury. What an ovation. January 7, 2002 in New York City. That was a historic night. When you look at Triple H's career as a whole, he is WWE history. When I think of all his conquests, I can't help but think of WrestleMania 25. Call me old fashioned, but the man was forced to defend his family and the WWE title. He did both, and that's beyond admirable. Nicely timed shot by Dean Ambrose. That strike hit the spot. There's no way he could have avoided that blow. The game dominating the match here in the early goings. I'm not sure I can watch this. No, not again. Well, the trick sometimes when you get outside the ring is survival. The match becomes almost secondary when you get near all these dangerous objects. Just look at this. I don't know how we can continue having a match under these circumstances. This is like a street beating. You know, all makes the cover. One, two. Few superstars are as dominant as this guy. Great moves. I'm not sure I can watch this. Looking to be in great shape here. It doesn't appear as though any damage has been done. Back between the ropes. Oh, once you get out of the ring, anything can happen. You've got exposed steel, concrete, the barricades, and all of it can be used to cause massive damage. Hey, so effective. Uh, Triple H needs to get back in this or he's going to be in real bad shape. Uh, like he says himself, things have to get worse before they can get better. That's what's happening. Arm trap, cross leg STF. Dean Ambrose is going to close it out. The lunatic friends may have things well in hand. The cerebral assassin has had many story wars in the annals of WWE. The one I'm thinking of was versus mankind. The shoulders are down. Two. Oh, look at that. He managed to get a shoulder up. Well, like they say, Cole, timing is everything. Triple H has such a drive, such a relentless will to succeed. Hey, now. And he gets leveled. Folks, I would not be surprised if we were looking at the crowning of a new champion here tonight. I don't recall the last time I saw a more focused challenger. Look at this! King, you mentioned the rivalries of the game, and man, that's it. He's done. Cover here. One, two, three. He did it. The winner and your new champion. Oh, boy. There was no law. Oh, they threw everything they had.